Mountain Dew beer butter ribs, motherfucker. Oh, yes. So we're going to start off with a bowl and a tenderizing fork. That's right. Take our fork. I stab you with my fork. I stab you with my fork. I will stab you with my fork. So take our honey barbecue ribs. The first step we're going to do is we're going to poke a bunch of holes in that meat to make this meaty treat to really savor the flavor. Oh, yes. So just take a fork and uh, stab the fuck out of your meat. Tenderize it. All that flavor will seep through and into, into the bones and into the meat. Yes, that one needs to be washed. All right, yes. Now we need to make our barbecue sauce. Now, we got some Kraft Honey Barbecue. We're going to give that a try, but we're going to customize it with some other goodies. So for starters, we're going to take our Country Crock Original. You want to plop some of that buttery goodness into our bowl. There we go. We're gonna microwave that so it melts. Yeah, just a little bit. Now, while that butter melts for our barbecue sauce, we're gonna take some seasoning for our ribs. We got our honey chipotle and our Rust County meats. Yes. So we're going to go ahead and coat these ribs with our seasoning. So we're going to add seasoning to our sauce too. There's our seasons. I'm going to rub that seasoning all over our meat. Yeah, you like rubbing that meat? Oh, yeah. Okay, don't be a pervert. Yes. Now that our butter is uh, melted, yes, we're going to add... Again, some more of our seasoned goodness. I'm going to add to our melted butter a sprinkle of that Rust County. A sprinkle of that honey chipotle barbecue. And then we're going to add a pinch of salt. A little, little, little bit of salt. And there we go. A little bit of salt. Now we're going to add some other ingredients to it. To thicken it up, we're going to add one can of Mountain Dew. Or half. Yes. Making some honey barbecue Mountain Dew ribs. Pour a little bit of that in there. And then we're going to add some Bud Light. half of that and now we're gonna mix it with our honey honey sauce right here from craft with the witchcraft sauce hold up a sec Ugh. come on you fucker Oh, yeah, so honey, that sweet honey barbecue sauce. 
some craft. We're gonna just throw that in there. Yes, throw a bunch of that in there. Now we'll thicken up our beer sauce just nicely. That's good sauce. Now I'm going to give it a stir. Give that a stir, baby. All that melted butter, that salt, the barbecue sauce, the beer, the Mountain Dew. Oh, yeah. That's going to be good. And we're making a mess all over the counter. Hold up. Oop, wipe that up. Oh, actually, that's not too bad. That combination, I'm liking that. Sweet, savory. You get to taste of the butter, the Mountain Dew, and the beer. I'm going to add some more sauce to thicken that up. That combination is swinging, YouTube. I'm liking that. Liking that a lot. Dump some more of that sauce in there. Have to cook the whole bottle. Splash more Mountain Dew. A little bit of beer. Okay, that's enough for our sauce. Give that a stir, boss. It's a little thick. Oh, YouTube. You can taste the Mountain Dew, the beer, and the honey barbecue sauce. Oh, yes. So we're going to take it and just kind of glaze our ribs with it. Very gently. All that buttery beer goodness with the Mountain Dew. We're going to just pour it all over our ribs. Yeah, just like that. We're gonna pour the sauce all over our ribs. Just like that. Pretty much the same formula as we do every time we make ribs on the channel. Throw it in the oven to bake after this. Not sure how it's going to turn out, but based off the flavor profile, off the uh, rib sauce that I made here, pretty dank. The Mountain Dew comes through with the barbecue sauce and the beer, and it just it complements it. We've been making our ribs a little spicy the last couple of rounds, so it may get a little bit sweeter. Yes. I'm going to dump the excess sauce into the sink. Hold on a second. So the only sauce we have is on our ribs. Really want to get these uh, coated in this, this, this custom made beer sauce. See all that beer and the, the honey and that barbecue sauce and that sugar from the Mountain Dew? These might be dank, you too. They just might be dank.
Yes. Mm. Oh yeah, these are gonna be dank, YouTube. We don't want too much sauce on the bottom of our pan, but just enough to coat the bottom of it. Just enough. Yeah, that looks beautiful. Mm. Yeah. Dude, the flavor profile with that craft sweet honey barbecue sauce and the beer and the Mountain Dew. That's not too shabby, dude. Not too shabby. I'm gonna rinse out the bowl real quick. Whatever. Spoon, wash that off. Yeah, making ribs is messy, but that's all right. Oh yeah, you can taste the Mountain Dew and the beer and the honey barbecue sauce with the seasoning. That's a perfect balance of flavor. Very nice, very nice. Excuse me, I farted. Oh shit. Now I take our leftover barbecue sauce and just kind of drizzle it on top. If there's any left. Eh. No, there really ain't any left. We used all the barbecue sauce in the recipe, but that's all right. The honey barbecue sauce from Kraft is pretty swinging, YouTube. All right, so let's take a look at these ribs. Let me dry off my hands, make a drink. Oh, yes. YouTube, look at it. Beautiful. Those are about to go in the oven. Then we're going to knife for separating the ribs later. Now we're going to make ourselves a little drink. Hmm. All right. Throw in our Mountain Dew. You want to use Mountain Dew throwback, that works too. Then they want to throw on a Bud Light. Now we got a little drink while we wait. Cheers, YouTube. We got some dank ribs on the way. Mm. Mountain Dew beer butter. Part one. I'm going to put these delicious bastards in the oven. Should I close up before we do that? Yes. Check it out. Oh, yeah. Let's get it. Oh, shit. Drop the phone. Whoops. All right. Let's put them in the oven. Right there on the second rack. Just like that. Beautiful. Go grab some napkins. We'll wipe up our mess. But anyways, tubes. That's part one. Part two, you're going to see me. They're already going to be plated and cut up and ready to try. That's what's up.